Hi guys, I'm Rebecca Robeson with Robeson Design. Welcome to Wedding Wednesdays. We're back at the RBN, and by now you guys should be pretty familiar with the place. Have you ever been yeah. here before? Okay. We are with the Archive Ladies, and we've also brought along Esther and Rajan, the florist. Now what would we need flower-wise, in your guys' opinion, down here? Obviously on the tables, but what are we envisioning? So now that we have decided on our furnishings and our florals, we got to figure out how to marry the two. Did you see how I did that? Yeah, the, the Mary part. I what mean, would we need? You, got, yeah. you already have like string lights kind of going through, so you don't want to go too heavy on the trees. Um, well, do you want that for the, your sweetheart? Yeah, behind the sweetheart. Yeah, probably. The flowers, you mean? Yeah. And if we use the mirrors that you guys picked, we could totally put them on the mirror. Exactly. Yeah. We're coming up with really great ideas for the setup. The sunset's at 4.45, so cocktail hour will probably go from like 3.45 to 4.45. We're also coordinating with the light vendor because it's going to be in fall and we're going to need some lights. I'm telling you, this wedding is a multi-layered process. We want it to feel like it's not daylight, but there's some really good ambiance lighting. You can see the decor, you can see the flowers. Mm -hmm. yeah, really absolutely. appreciate it. And then I'll show you, since you haven't seen it, the ballroom. Hold on, hold on. I have a question. Oh. We're going to need a grand conductor. Archive is going to be setting up, the hotel is going to be doing their things, and the catering, and the flowers. I mean, someone has got to be like the chief. Someone, not me. Who is the main person that is controlling the overall design of all these different spaces? It's kind of like an install. I mean, basically, you need to have, it's, it's a theatrical production, right? So there's got to be someone who's going to take the lead and you know, kind of be in charge of who's doing what, when, and where, because God knows I'm going to be sipping on a Mai Tai by the pool after I get my mani-pedi, my massage, put my lashes on. I'll just maybe be the communication person between archives. Yes. That's what, what I'm I was saying. Is yeah. I feel like there's, yeah. we got moving Like you're our representative in a sense. Now that everyone's 2020 on the dinner vision, it's time to move down to the golf course and talk about the ceremony. So how do we take this wide open space and narrow the focus in on our ceremony? So we'll have a heavy garland kind of draping all the, almost like kind of snaking up like the arms and like the legs of the, the tree. And then I want like a lot of like just flower heads just sprinkled across like this area, like the dirt area. With the heads, do you envision like big piles of flowers? Like, like on the, the base, totally, and then, the and then kind of sprinkled into out. them, I yes. That. I love that. Yes. Perfect. It's, Me too. It's great. Did you just say white columns? Yeah. They're old. White They're wood. Shabbier wood. <laughs> One of the things to decide on is the ceremony entrance. You know, down the aisle way when we walk down. On the archive art boards, they had suggested these gates. Like Wait, do you the, like these gates? Stamps. No? That's okay. You don't like the wrought iron? Wrought iron is not my first choice. But I've reached an enlightened state. I, honestly, I'm at the point where I'm ready to just say, you guys are really professionals at it. You're the best of the best. That's who we've got working for us. I should step away and let you do what you do best. Just like I want you to do that with me. And that way, we can just... Yeah. <laughs> and with that, it was time to say goodbye to the ladies of Archive for the day. Because we had some real important business to attend to. You know, like practicing with your dad and your mom being your dad and your dad being your groom. It was weird. So he's come along for today because he's going to be officiating the ceremony. Did you know that? My husband is a minister. Isn't that cute? And just a little side note, when I got married, my dad officiated my ceremony because he too is a minister. Another big consideration for any wedding is entertainment. Well, Jim and I got an invitation to attend a special event to check out a potential performer. The event was held at a nice hotel in Del Mar. How you doing? Hey. Okay. Armando is also in the design business. He's a great friend and he's the one who invited us here tonight. Sasha is a really talented singer that performs in a variety of musical styles. And I've seen her in a bunch of different venues. Well, this night at the supper club, 
the band was performing in a traditional Cuban theme. Falling in love can breathe. I'm definitely going to recommend Sasha for the wedding. I am too young to know. Hey. Take a picture with me with her so we can send of it course. to Sharon. She's in New York yes. and she's missing this, but we gotta wait for these okay. girls. I'm not really sure what this photo op thing is about, but I'm taking pictures and gonna send it to Shara. I was kind of thinking maybe this girl would be really great as the guest book attendant at the wedding. If I look fat, you lose your job. If I look fat, I'm not blaming it on the phone, I'm blaming it on you. You know what I'm saying? Thank you for joining me this week for this episode of Wedding Wednesdays. You know what? The wedding is getting so close and it's so exciting. And I'm glad that you guys can be a part of it with us. I want to invite you to something that we do here at Ropes and Design. And it's the last Saturday of every month. And that's called the Design Sessions. It's where I teach you everything I know about interior design. If you're at all interested in increasing and improving your skills and gaining confidence in your own decorating, check it out on my website, which is ropesanddesign.com. Also, please be sure to subscribe to this channel, leave us a thumbs up, and feel free to leave us a comment. We always love to hear what you have to say and uh, touch base with each other. All right, we will see you guys next time. Come back because we're going to have some reveal videos coming very, very, very soon of the project we just finished here in Southern California. Okay? From all of us at Ropes and Design, we'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye. Heavy garland is kind of draping all the way around. Oops. Sorry, Matthew, don't get that. <laughs> Ha, ha, ha.